Hey, welcome to another episode of This Guy's Thoughts. Uh, if you like what you see here, like the video, subscribe to my channel, uh, feel free to leave a comment. Uh, tonight's episode is going to feature a hard cider. Uh, it has several different types of hard ciders. Uh, this one here, um, believe it or not, I found it at Aldi Grocery Store about a year ago. Saw it in one of their sales ads. I uh, stopped in there and picked some up. Um, this is actually a very good cider. I've bought this a few times since then. That's a six pack, I want to say. Uh, here it's maybe um, six or seven dollars, a few dollars cheaper than uh, some of the other uh, more popular brands of hard cider. But anyhow, this is a five percent ABV. That's called Wicked Grove Hard Cider. It says Wicked Good Crisp Apple. Uh, check that out. I hope that's coming out okay on the camera there. Uh, the bottle cap, it's just kind of got like a, like an apple with a face kind of smirking or giving you a wicked grin there. Uh, let's see, this is a naturally gluten-free, uh, 5% uh, ABV, like I said. Uh, I couldn't really find much out about this. It said it's brewed by... I'm sorry, brewed by, it's produced by Wicked Grove Cidery in uh, Middlebury, Vermont. Uh, that's, I'm sure that's a subsidiary of something that I don't really feel like looking up and trying to figure out where it's from. But anyhow, it's been a while since I've had this, probably a few months. Uh, it's been in the refrigerator, it's ice cold. Got that tart apple smell. Uh, it's got that uh, real clear wine look to it, like a wine. If you like wine, you like sweet wine, uh, this is something that you might like. Uh, extremely clear, um, total transparent. Not sure how well it's coming up there on the camera. You get that tarty, sweet smell from it. Um, Definitely a sweet cider in my opinion. Uh, one of, it's actually one of the better ones. For the price, you can't go wrong with this price. Taste wise. Nice bitterness to it, nice tarty taste to it. Uh, very sweet taste to it. Uh, it is gluten free. Uh, it says 210 calories per bottle. Again, this is at Aldi Grocery Store. I've never seen it anywhere else. I don't know if it's like an Aldi special. I don't really know. Uh, but anyhow, this is something, if you're a hard cider guy or lady, this is something you need to go out and uh, pick up. For no more than it costs, you can't go wrong. Um, let's see. I'm trying to think of a hard cider um, to compare it to. Uh, maybe a couple, maybe Woodchuck probably has something that tastes similar to this. I know Stella has a hard cider that's pretty good. Um, this, this for the price, it ranks right up there with them. This is highly recommended. Um, using my normal scale of judging, uh, a zero means I don't want to see this crap ever again. A six is I push a old person down to get the last bottle. Um, this is going to be a four. Um, and I'm going to judge this on ciders, where I rank it on ciders. This would be a four out of six. Um, I would drink this anytime it's available. I would actually prefer this over some of the other larger, uh, big name brands of cider companies. Very good. Like I said, tart finish to it. If you like that tarty sweetness, uh, this is something you need to try. Go out, uh, if it's in your area, if there's an Aldi in your area, if this is in the supermarket, uh, the Aldi supermarket in your area, pick it up. Like I said, you can't really beat the price. Um, price point alone makes it worth buying. Anyhow, it's going to be a four out of six. Uh, pick it up, check it out for yourself. That's my thoughts. <laughs>